welcome to Lighthouse for Jesus Ministries under the leadership of Apostle Donnie Bolden Sr. And we know that right now we are in some very unsure times, but we thank you guys for just hanging in there and tuning in with us and having a worship experience in the ways that we can. Again, thank you for joining us and we hope that you're blessed by today's service. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Oh God, let all the people praise you. For you inhabit the praises of your people. I need somebody to come on and clap those hands if you gotta praise. Come on, I've got to praise him. Gotta let it out. Come on, go tell somebody what he's all about. Come on, y'all. What? He calls me his own, the King of Glory. Ah, come on, come on! I've got to let it out. I got a praise in my mouth. Yeah, yeah. Come on, the praise. Gotta let it out. Go tell the nations what he's all about. Listen, y'all, he lives within me. And God calls me his own. He's the king of glory. Ah, he sits on his throne. Come on, y'all. Somebody help me sing it again. Come on. Oh. Come on. Come on, we're going to say this together. Come on and clap those hands. Ooh, I've got to let it out. Hey there, is today your first time here? Or maybe your first time in a while? If so, maybe you're wondering exactly who we are and what this church is all about. Well, we'd like you to know that we're a group of ordinary people who are on an amazing journey together, following Christ. Our guide is the Bible because it's the divinely inspired Word of God and it will never take us in the wrong direction. Along the way, we hope you'll see that we are welcoming and spiritually passionate and that getting to know you is a big deal to us. We know that the road is rough sometimes, but we'll work really hard to bring you practical and relevant messages to equip and encourage you through life's ups and downs. We want you to know that we care about this community, and we believe that it's our job to make it a better place. So, no matter who you are or where you've been, we're glad you're here with us today. And we hope that you'll join us on our journey, following Christ and living out His plan for us. So, welcome to church.
everybody. We welcome you to uh, Lighthouse for Jesus ministry. Under the leadership of Apostle Donnie Bowden Sr. and Minister Cindy Bowden. We thank you, Lord, for just having an opportunity tonight. Because we know, Lord God, that as today with the turmoil and everything that's going on, we, we, we know that they have to have a word tonight for the people. What I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the Lord in prayer. Hallelujah. We honor you, Lord, tonight. We give you the glory tonight. We praise you, O oh God. Because you're God all by yourself. Lord God, we know that you are able, Lord, to do anything but fail. So we come against every distraction. We come against every warfare of the mind. We tear down every stronghold tonight. We ask you to set the atmosphere, Lord, for you to move, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, remove every hindrance, every doubt, every unbelief. We tear it down right now. We ask you to touch hearts and minds tonight. That someone will receive from you. Lord. And that your word will fall upon good ground. Before I begin to minister tonight. I have a song. That I want you to hear. I'm going to turn it over to. Bishop Donnie Bolton Jr. right now. Oh, Lord. 
giving honor to God, who is the leader of my life. Hallelujah. And I give honor tonight to the leader of this house, Apostle Donnie Bolden. A man that taught me so much. Glory to God. That stuck with me. Through thick and thin. Hallelujah. I thank God tonight. I thank God tonight. That God is a real God. that I know that the devil is mad because I know he thought he had me hallelujah glory to God I was a man that was lost that God had for my life. Glory to God. Tonight I'm going to try to give you a word from the Lord because I know he has spoken something powerful. The title of my message tonight Are you in the light or are you in the darkness? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. God is a real God. And he showed me some things in the word of God. I'm going to go to the word of God tonight. And I'm starting the first book of the Bible. I'm going to start with Genesis 1. And the word of God said, In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. And the earth was without form and void. And darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. And God said, let there be light. And there was light. And God saw the light, that it was good. And God divided the light from the darkness. And God called the light day, and darkness he called night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God himself came on the scene. He came on the scene because they didn't have nothing but void. And nothing was there. But we know that God said, let there be light. And people don't understand that this was not the first thing that people think that it was. But God himself was the light. It's not like the fourth day when he said about the light, the moon, and the star. He was the light. He came into existence and he showed us that if we would just look at the skies right now, when you wake up in the morning, that you have a chance to come to the light. Because God is light. Hallelujah. Glory to God. That light that we see when we wake up in 
the morning. We got to know that it is God. Yes, it is. It's God, I said. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. I'm going to break down a little bit tonight, oh God. Now I'm going to go to John 1. Hallelujah. John 1 and 1. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. See, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, the same in the beginning with God, all things was made by Him, and without anything that was made, it had to be made of the Lord, hallelujah, in Him, I'm telling you, in Him, was life. And the life was the light of men. And the light shining in darkness. And the darkness comprehended not. There was a man, hallelujah, glory to God, sent from God, whose name was John. The same came for a witness to bear witness of the light. That all men through him might believe. He was not that light, but was sent to bear witness of that light. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. That light was the true light. Hallelujah. It was the true light. Glory to God. Which is the light. Every man that come into the world. He was in the world, and the world received him not. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. The word was made by him. The world was created by God. It was a light that God came in with. That's why they couldn't comprehend him. Because they didn't even know. Because they couldn't see him. Because he was a light. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God. Even to them that believe on his name, which is born not of blood, nor of the will of flesh, nor the will of man, but of God. And the word, the world, that word was made flesh. And it what dwell among us. When it was made flesh, let me tell you something. That word was made from the light of God. He was the light. And when he came into the flesh, hallelujah, they could not see him, but hallelujah, they seen a figure of God. They seen flesh, but they did not see God. Hallelujah. They say that we beheld his glory and the glory of as the only begotten of the Father, mm -hmm. full of grace and truth. Now John bad witness of him and cried saying, this was him who I spoke of and he came after me. It was preferred before me for he was before me. And of his fullness have all we received. And grace for grace, for the law was given by Moses. But grace and truth came by Jesus. Are you in the light? Or are you in darkness? Come on. No man have seen God at any time. The only begotten Son which is the bosom of the Father. He has declared him. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I'm trying to go somewhere with this thing. Now we're going to John 8 and 12. Hallelujah. 
Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. And Jesus said unto them, Hallelujah, glory to God. Just a little error right there. 8 and 12. Then spake Jesus again to them, saying, I am the light of the world. He that followed me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Now I'm going to go to John 9 and 5. Come on. Preach the word. Hallelujah. Glory to God. If everybody have John chapter 9, verse 5. And it reads, as long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. Hallelujah. Come on, that's good. That's good. Glory to God. You know, you can define light as the gospel of the glory of Christ. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. I want to let y'all know tonight that I was in the darkness. I was set up in darkness. Come on. The darkness that I didn't even know what was going on. The darkness that I was strung out somebody tonight. Yeah. Might be in darkness. They might be strung out tonight on drugs, alcohol, hallelujah, glory to God. They might even be strung out on going out all night, going to clubs all night. But at this time, the Lord slowed up a couple of things, hallelujah. Because he called down all the club for a while. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. He shut down some darkness because some people couldn't even leave darkness. Hallelujah. God had to do it for them. Ooh, woo. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Real. Glory to God. The darkness is evil. Yep. It's evil. I'm telling you, I was in that situation for years. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I didn't know which way to go. Hallelujah. I tried everything, just like a lot of people that's watching me today. Hallelujah. You might be trying anything. You might be trying alcohol. You might be trying women. You might be trying everything that you think of. Hallelujah. Because you're in the darkness. It's the evilness when you're in the darkness. Yeah. God himself said he was above all that we all be saved and filled with the gift of the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Hallelujah. That's why he came as light. Hallelujah. He came that you could see. When you woke up this morning and you opened up your eyes and you walked through your door, all you see was light. Come on. And it was the light of God. My God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You might not even see the sun, but it was still light. Because God wants that light to transfer inside of you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. That light, that light that shines shine just above all light, is God. I say it's God. He said in the beginning it was the Word. Who is the Word? <laughs> Jesus. Yes. Who is Jesus? He is the light. Yeah. On, Mike, Hallelujah. Yeah. The light of God. I'm telling you. Jesus 
himself came down not through one generation but 42 generations just to save us just to redeem us hallelujah to the Lamb of God the God that we serve is the mighty God hallelujah I didn't even know about that light hallelujah glory to God the light of God I came down hallelujah to a little church named Lighthouse for Jesus it's something special because on that title it said Lighthouse for Jesus Lighthouse for Jesus hallelujah Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. I'm letting you know that that lighthouse that I came to, hallelujah, I was coming to receive the light. Come on, man. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 I went to every doctor possible, every hospital possible. Glory to God. But guess what? It couldn't help me. Talk to us, huh? Hallelujah. I went to the hospitals. I stayed months and months and months with a 12-step program. Glory to God. Jesus. Glory to God. They say you're going to be all right. All you have to do is have a partner. Call him in time of need. Yeah. He can help you. He can give you some strength. Hallelujah. I tried that. I tried it. Hallelujah. I called my partner. Mm. Glory to God. All he did was hand me something to do. Let's get high, my brother. He could only give me what he had. And that was darkness. Hallelujah. We're still talking about, are you in the light? Or are you in darkness? Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm letting you know that the Lord was calling upon me from the very time I was born. Yes. Glory to God. But I tried everything but him. Amen. Hallelujah. But when I came down to the little church called Light House, and it was preaching about that life. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Come on, come on. There is preaching about that light. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. How you get that light? I want to know. Because <laughs> I want to be out of darkness. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I'm talking about the light of God. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. I want to let you know tonight that God began to deal with me inside. Jesus. Inside. You know how people be sorry for different things. Every time I would get in trouble, every time I would do something I didn't have no business doing, I would run to the Lord. Say, Lord, I'm sorry. Glory to God. You know how you're doing? People, you're watching me right now. You're watching me right now. If you're watching me right now and you're going back and forth, hallelujah, thinking that you don't need God. Thinking that you could just say, Lord, I'm sorry. It don't work just like that. Hallelujah. Glory to God. When it do work, don't. It has to be a godly sorrow. It has to come from the heart inside of you. And it has to be godly. Because if it's not godly, no change. No change. Every time I said, Lord, I'm sorry, nothing happened. And I was calling the Lord name. And nothing happened. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lord God. Oh, 
Masanda Rabakushanda Rabahaya. God, God is the light. I say, God is the light. Hallelujah. Somebody told me, son, until you come to the Lord with your whole heart, mind, and soul, glory to God. Thank God for a prophet in the house of God. Thank God for a pastor that's called after God's heart. What do you tell you the truth? Tell you how to get that light. Hallelujah. When they ask, what you been doing? I said, I've been going through and fro, seeking a word, seeking help, seeking this and that. All you have to do, son, is come real, they said, with the law. Come on. Glory to God. They said, you got to come real. I said, what you mean real? They said, you got to come out of yourself. Get rid of the darkness. For real. You got to repent. For real. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. One night. Hallelujah. I was sick and tired of being sick and tired. Come on, come on, come on. Glory to God. So to you. Come on. I was sick and tired, I said. Oh no. And I walked up to the altar of God. <laughs> Hallelujah. And I lifted up my hand before the Lord. And I began. To talk to the Lord. I begin to tell the Lord all that I've done. Come on. And I don't know what point that happened. But when I lifted out my vessel before yeah. the Lord. Yeah. Woo! The light came in. My God, my God. Hallelujah! Yeah. The light came in. Yeah. Glory to God. And when the light came in, it began to destroy and run darkness out of my life. Are you in the light? Or are you in dark? Make it plain. Make it plain. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The light began to make me act right. Talk right. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. It began to make me talk like I had some sense. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You know when you're in the darkness, guess what? You think you're talking. You think you're walking. You think you're seeing. And you're in the light. And you think you're seeing. But guess what? You're still in darkness. Jesus, Jesus. The scale has got to come off your eyes. Yes. Hallelujah. I was like one of them characters in the Bible. Saul. Hallelujah. Persecuting everything. Persecuting the church. Talking about people. And everything. But I was blind. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I said my name had to be changed. <laughs> yes, indeed. It had to be. Come on. The only way I could do anything right is after my name had to be changed. Come on. The light had to come inside of me. Amen. Hallelujah. You know when God start dealing with you. And start working in your life. That's when you can say, no weapon fall against me shall prosper. Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus said, Very, very, I say unto you, if you 
cannot eat the flesh of the Son of God and drink his blood. You have no life in you. Hallelujah. Whosoever eat the flesh and drink the blood of Jesus is drink indeed. He that eat of the flesh and drink of the blood, he said, dwell in me and I in him. Hallelujah. Something got to be right. Some light got to be turned on in you for God to move. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Are you in the light? Or are you in darkness? Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm telling you, the light is the word of God. I said the light is the word of God. That's why God say, hallelujah, glory to God. The word of God is quick and powerful and sharper than any two edged sword. Passing even to the soul and the marrow of the bone. Even to the son of the thoughts and the intent of the heart. The only way it can go through all those things that is light. It is light. It's the only thing that get through all of that light. And who is light? Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. The light of the world yes. came to redeem us yes. from darkness. Yes. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. You're worthy, O Lord. You're worthy to be praised. You're worthy to be magnified. You're worthy to be glorified. And I glorify you, O God, today. He said, Thy word have I hid in my heart that I might not sin against thee. Hallelujah. How can you hide something in your heart if it's not light? It got to be light. Especially if they're not doing any surgery with a knife. It's a laser beam. It's light. Hallelujah. It's light that saves you. It's light that delivers you. It's light that heal you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. I said, I know that that was bad tonight. Hallelujah. He didn't want the light of God to shine tonight. Hallelujah. I'm supposed to be dead. Hallelujah. I'm supposed to be dead. Hallelujah. I had cancer twice. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Twice. Hallelujah. Only the hand of God. Some people be speaking different things, but I know that in the word of God, that when God speaks a thing, he speaks it through the prophets of God. The prophets of God. Hallelujah. I want to thank God. Hallelujah. I want to thank God. Hallelujah. For being in the ministry. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. That is seeking God in a mighty way. That carries the fivefold ministry. Glory to God. That has every gift. Hallelujah of the word of God. Amen. Amen. Every gift. If I could give you just a little, just a little testimony oh. about the gifts that lay hold in this house. Oh. Glory to God. Everything you see, everything you hear, God did. Glory to God. He spoke it. And it happened. Hallelujah. It's the light, y'all. He spoke it. 
And he did. He spoke to one of my brothers in the church. He said, everything you touch, you're going to be able to play. God spoke it in here. Guess what? He led a song tonight for me. Hallelujah. Glory to God. That's the kind of God I've served. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah is the highest praise. God called every elder that I know that's in the house of God. He called them by name. He spoke a word. Hallelujah. In this house. Glory to God. He prepared us. Hallelujah. Glory to God. He spoke a word. To the elderly ladies in the house. Glory to God. Thank you Jesus. To pray for the nations. And that was years ago. Boy, the nation still need them prayers. Hallelujah. It was called for it out of this house. Oh, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. He called for it. This is just a little testimony of the goodness of God through this house. He called for some dancers. Woo! The name of was Prophetic Seed. And when he called them for, just think about it. Nobody didn't know how to dance. But when he called them for, the light went in them. They began to destroy yokes as they danced to the glory of God. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. I mean, that happened in this house. It's happening right now. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm telling you right now. I'm not supposed to be walking. I'm not supposed to be talking. Yeah. Glory to God. But do you hear me now? Amen. Woo! Are you in the light? Or are you still in darkness? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. I'm just telling you about the goodness of God. Come on. I thank God tonight that God is a God all by himself. I thank God that he's the light of the world. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. And he said in the word of God, when I read the fifth verse of John 9, he said, when no man could work, Right at the end of the fourth verse, and then he went into the fifth verse, and he said, as long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He said, as long as he's in the world. Hallelujah. So what God is doing, he's throwing lights in people. Hallelujah. He said, if you walk in the light, and he is the light, we have fellowship one with another. Amen. Glory to God. In that light, it do some things. Yes, it does. Hallelujah. People don't understand, you can't walk in the kind of way. God said, when you get that light, you are a raw priest. A priest. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You are different. Don't try to be like nobody else. Be like the light. Come on, Doug. Hallelujah. And when that light come upon you, he said you're going to take off some fruits. <laughs> yeah. ha, some fruits. Some real fruits. How you gonna know your brothers and your sisters? Those that have love one for another. We begin when we get that light. Hallelujah. To 
take on some things. Like love. I mean real love. I mean agape love. When you got that light in you, hallelujah, you can set anybody and mean it. I love you. The Lord come again, he said, the joy of the Lord. You got to have real joy. Real joy. Real joy. Not happiness, but joy. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Goodness come after that. Long suffering. Can anybody say they can long suffer love for a long time when something going wrong? You can't do it without the light. You got to have the real light to suffer long. Hallelujah. Glory to God. If you want to have the right and the right goodness and the right, hallelujah, glory to God, faith, you got to have the light. That's part of the thing that God did in you. That's why it's called the fruit of the Spirit. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Come on. Faith. It's that now faith of something thing and evidence of things not seen. Ooh, when you don't see nothing, which is hallelujah, nothing. But it's still working. You know why? Because it's the light that's in you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Come on. Thank you, Jesus. That's that faith that God is talking about. That's that faith that God is talking about. I'm telling you. Then he goes out and he says something about meekness. For real meek, if you don't have that light. Are you still in the light or are you in darkness? Mm. Temperance. Hallelujah. You know flesh I act up, but God, God, the light in you calls temperance. Because he said, against those fruit of the spirit, there is such thing as no law. None. But he said that those that put upon Christ crucify that no good dark flesh. Flesh is darkness. Hallelujah. It's darkness. Glory to God. That's why he said if you live in the spirit, let us also walk in the spirit. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. When you get that light, God said in his word, my brother, my sister, I beseech you, hallelujah, that you may present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, holy, holy. How you can be holy if you're in the flesh? It has to be in the light, holy and acceptable that the will of God. And when you do the will of God, he said, be ye not conformed to this world, but be you transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is good and acceptable, perfect will of God. Are you in the light? Or are you in darkness? Come on, man. Come on, God is good, man. Once you get the light inside of you, Sky is the limit. The only thing that's going back to God is in the light. You got to be in the light. Hallelujah. You know the light is transferred. You don't see it. But you know what? The spirit of God is in the light. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God is truth. The light is truth. God tell us, sanctify yourself through the word of God, the truth of the word of God. God is true. The word is true. The world, the word is life. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God is a real God. He don't miss nothing. How sweet 
is thy word to thy taste. He says, sweeter than honey to thy mouth. Amen. That's what he said. Through thy precept, I get understanding. Understanding. And he said, you begin to hate every false way. Yeah. Thy word is a lamp unto my feet yeah. and a light unto my path. Yes. Hallelujah. The light of God is a razor thing. It's cut straight through you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. I thank God tonight for that light. Amen. I thank God tonight for God being God. I thank God for my mom tonight. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus, that she's still here with us. Glory to God. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Without her, I wouldn't even be here. Amen. Amen. Oh, I thank God. I thank God for this ministry. You know, I thank God for the man of God of this house. A lot of people don't even know a lot of things about my leader. He took me in. When everything was going wrong, when everything was dark, he brought me in. He drew me to the light. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. I thank God for Apostle Donnie Bowden Sr. Hallelujah. I thank God for the spirit of this place. Glory to God. I thank God, hallelujah. That the spirit is still running. Hold on, Washanda. With all power Amen. in this place. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. I'm telling you right now that God is a spirit, and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Can you see a spirit? On every take form on something. But other than that, guess what? It's the light. You can't see it. You might get a glimpse of something, and the light just passes. I've seen it many times in the front of this altar. Hallelujah. That it just whew, passed in the front of the altar. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God said, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I am crucified with Christ. Nevertheless, not I, but Christ that liveth in me. The life that I now live is through faith in the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. That's why I thank you, because he gave himself for me. That a light came down inside of me. Glory to God. I didn't know what was going on tonight. But all I know is God said something. He spoke something to me. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And I want to let y'all know tonight. Hallelujah. Love not the world. Neither the things that's in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in you. Because all that's in the is lust of the flesh, lust of the eyes, and the pride of life. Hallelujah. And it's not of the Father, but of the world. He said the world passed away. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. And the lust passed away. But that one thing, not the will of God, going to pass away. You know what he's going to do? It's going to buy forever. Glory to God. I'm slowly coming to an end. And the word of God said, and that knowing the time, that now is hard time to wake out of the sleep. It's hard time for us to wake out our sleep. 
For now, our salvation draw near and near than we ever seen before. Hallelujah. The night is far spent. The day is at hand. Let us therefore cast off the works of darkness. Let us get rid of darkness. And let us put up on the armor of light. Hallelujah. Let us walk honestly as the day go in. Not riding. You know how they're riding and doing every kind of thing in the world right now. He said, not don't they don't want you to be there. Not in drunkenness, you know. Everybody's trying to get drunk because of the pandemic. Hallelujah. To forget things. Not in chambering and wantonness. Not in strife. Everybody going against each other. And envy. Trying to come. Trying to do this against each other. But put you on the Lord Jesus. And make that no provision for the flesh. To fulfill the lust there. Because all lust is, is dark. Are you walking in the light? Or are you in darkness? I tell you tonight that I thank God that the light came in just in time. Just in time to save me. God's words tells you a lot. Repent and be baptized, every one of you, for the remission of sins, and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. What is the Holy Ghost? The light of God. It is a promise to you, to me, to your children, to them that are even far off. Hallelujah. God loves us, y'all. He wants to redeem us. He wants to save us. He wants to deliver us. So while you're listening tonight, I ask you a question. Are you in the light or are you in darkness? If you're in the light, get more light. If you're in darkness, come to the light. Hallelujah. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! God is beckoning us. He's beckoning us. Hallelujah! Father, look down upon us. Look down upon your people. Those that are hurting. Those that are in distress. Those that are weak. Those that are going in the hospital, those that are on the street corner, those, Lord God, minds that don't know what to do, those that are so confused, we know that there's a solution. And the solution is come to the light. Come to the light of God and he'll straighten up everything. He'll make your life light up according to his will, according to his way, and everything would line up, line upon line, and precept upon precept, here and there, and there. I thank God tonight. I thank you for this opportunity to come forth with the word of God. Hallelujah. 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 I thank God. I thank God for his delivering power because he's truly delivered. For his healing power because he truly healed. For his miracle working power because it's for sure a miracle that I'm in. Hallelujah. I give all the glory, all the honor, and 
all the praise to that light. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. That gave himself for me.